Namaste everyone. Thank you for joining in this video. So in today's video, I want to talk about how and why Saturn can be quite detrimental to your wealth. Okay. And how, you know, how Saturn makes Lakshmi run away. Okay. Now this is not my statement. This is Parashara statement. And he says that Saturn makes Lakshmi run away. But why does Parashara make such a sweeping statement despite the fact that it is the great Parashara who says that Saturn and Lakshmi or Saturn and Venus who is the representative of Lakshmi are good friends okay so to understand this you must go to the basics of Jyotish and if you look at the you know if you look at the friendly relationships of planets then you have to understand two things okay number one although Saturn and Venus are considered to be friends that friendship is very exploitative. That friendship has a very exploitative nature to it. Okay. And even if you look at it logically, Saturn is known as the Dukha Karaka, the Karaka for sorrow. Venus is known as the Sukha Karaka, the Karaka for happiness. So whenever, you know, the Karaka for sorrow coming to the Karaka for happiness and the Karaka of sorrow coming together with the Karaka of happiness is obviously going to be troublesome. Okay. So, it's a natural thing if you look at it. You know, if you are very sad, then we search for people who are happy because only they can make us happy. And that is how, you know, as I said, this relationship between Saturn and Venus is very exploitative by nature. Okay. But then how, why does Parashara say that, say explicitly that Saturn makes Lakshmi run away? It's because of two reasons. Okay. The first reason is because Saturn is the Karaka for arguments and quarrels. And in whichever house there are quarrels or arguments or fights, in whichever house the members keep on constantly fighting with each other, in whichever house there is a lack of peace, Lakshmi does not stay in those houses. Okay, Fights and arguments are a sure, short way to chase Lakshmi, you know, to make Lakshmi run away from you. Okay, so if you have a lot of money, but, you know, you are... You are having fights and arguments in your houses. If you're making a lot of money, that money will never stay with you. That money will eventually run away from you. Okay. And uh, to put things in perspective from the other side, if you want to make more money in your life, then try to have a more peaceful home environment. Okay. If the people around in your house does not don't allow you to live in peace or to be in peace, then I would recommend moving away from your house and staying somewhere alone peacefully because peace is the first requirement for Lakshmi to come into your life. Okay, so that is the first requirement. Now, and the second reason why Lakshmi runs away is because of cluttering, is because people have their homes very untidy. Okay, because some people's houses are just filled with a lot of dust, a lot of dirt. Okay. So Saturn is dust. Saturn is, you know, is the mismanagement of things. Okay. So if you have a place in your house, even if it's a storeroom, which is managed or which is maintained in a very mismanaged way, then also you'll face blockages in your wealth. You'll face blockages while trying to make money. Your money will not stay with you. Okay. Similarly, if you are in the habit of keeping your house dirty, or if you're a habit, if you're in the habit of, say, keeping your car dirty, you know, Venus is the car of her vehicles. So if dirt starts accumulating on your car and you don't take care of your car every day or of your vehicle every day, then also money is going to run away from you. Okay. So it's very essential that you keep not only keep your house clean, you also keep your vehicles clean so that you allow Lakshmi, you allow that wealth to flow into your lives. Okay, so the other way how you can, you know, how you make Lakshmi run away and how or how Saturn makes Lakshmi run away is by your feet, okay, by your untidy feet. Say if you have come home from outside and you have the habit of bringing your shoes inside, you know, your entire house gets filled with the dirt that you have, that your shoes have gathered from the outside world. And then what happens is that is another reason why money does not stay with people. Okay. And then some people, they go even further. They have a habit of, you know, of not washing their feet before climbing onto the bed. You know, the bed represents the 12th house. It represents the natural sign of Pisces where Lakshmi exalts. So if you get onto your bed with your dirty, you know, with your dirty feet or without washing your feet, then it's a sure shot way of making Lakshmi run away. 
okay so keep this in mind every time you come home from outside the best thing is to leave your shoes outside your home that is a part of indian culture all over you know it's also a part of etiquettes that you should keep your shoes outside whenever you visit someone else's house you should follow the same etiquette when you come to your house as well you know you should always keep your shoes outside if you are coming from somewhere else okay that reflects uh that tells a lot about your manners that tells a lot about your upbringing but that will also help a lot in trying in you know in helping in enabling you to make more money okay so keep your shoes outside leave your shoes outside and then as you enter home you know if you have to go straight to the bed for example you have come home late at night and you you have to go straight to the bed please make a habit of washing your feet before going to sleep okay because just like your bed your feet also represents the 12th house and if you keep your feet clean keep your feet free from dirt and dust and whatever it's a way to ensure that lakshmi starts flowing on to your life okay so please remember these things as you contemplate on this statement of parashara as to why saturn makes lakshmi run away from you and i am sure you will find a lot of you know a lot of parallels to what i have just mentioned in the video okay so that's it from me in this video do like the content if you find it useful please share it with your friends and family and also with those who you think will benefit from this and subscribe to the channel and if you want a consultation regarding your chart you're always free to reach out at the number provided in the description box that's it i'll see you soon in yet another video namaste om gurave namaha